Today, I'm challenging my kids to a foam pit challenge. Last to leave wins $100. This is my wife, Melanie. I'm dragging her along to help me with this challenge. This is Gary. He's very important, and you'll find out why later. The chubby bunny. <laughs> and these are my crazy kids. <laughs> Here's what's gonna happen. Me, my wife, and my kids will be jumping into this large foam pit. Every 25 minutes, we'll be doing a challenge. And if you can't complete that challenge, then you get a strike. Get three strikes and you're out. If at any time your body gets halfway out of the pit, it's an automatic disqualification. Let's get started. Wait to the end to see what happens to the loser. Okay, if you're, if you're ready, give me a thumbs up just so I know. Three, two, one. <laughs> I heard there was a sandwich buried at the bottom of the I don't think you... <laughs> Six minutes later. This is already getting, this is already getting hard. Leave my space, leave, leave my space alone. Rocket, get out of my space. <laughs> I have a plan and I don't want them in my space. Now, this is gonna get much, much harder. Every 25 minutes, we will all be doing a mystery challenge. If you cannot complete the challenge, you get one strike. Three strikes and you're out. For our first challenge, we're gonna play Chubby Bunny, seeing Pops. <laughs> this is the Chubby Bunny. You have to eat <laughs> as many marshmallows as you can. Oh. You just eat marshmallows? Oh, you can't chubby swallow bunny? them. You gotta no. just chubby chubby You have to keep it in your, mouth, in your mouth and then say chubby bunny. bunny. And then you have to put another <laughs> one in your mouth to say chubby bunny. And you have to do it until you can not say chubby bunny anymore. <laughs> it's the chubby ref leading the chubby yeah. bunny. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Gary. Ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> On, on, on rocket, just one rocket. On the count of three. One, two, three. Chubby, Chubby bunny. bunny. <laughs> Dark number two. <laughs> they have no strategy. Rocket's gonna show. Yeah. Okay, so Melanie lost. Now, what does that mean? Is she out? I didn't win this challenge. <laughs> oh, okay. Get out. out. Okay, everyone, if you have marshmallow mouth, everyone say chubby bunny. Chubby bunny. Chubby bunny. Oh, oh. If you didn't pass this challenge, then you get a strike. If you get three strikes, then you're out. Yeah. One, one marshmallow and you're out. Okay, everyone grab another marshmallow. Eyes <laughs> oh, are watering. Who? Axel. Mom, <laughs> it's you good. <laughs> All right. Tell me, buddy. I'm, I'm still in. You did three? Oh. Well, you can do four for pride, but the challenge is over. Okay, yeah, that's just what I need to do and go in. Huh? We're gonna check the tape. Rockets, how are you feeling? Um, Graham came out for me and we're making it out so we can stay in here for like days. But you realize there's only one winner. So you're okay if you guys, one of you guys lose as long as you guys are at the end. We'll split it. Yeah. I'm helping you. Remy, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good. What's your strategy to win? Same as Rockets. Chinley, how are you feeling? Terrible. What's your strategy to win? So I'm gonna chill and then when the challenge starts, so then I get energy before the challenge starts. Audio, how are you feeling? Doing great. Oh! What's your strategy to win? Sleep and burrow, burrow underground. It distracts me from the time. How are you feeling? Nauseous. What's your strategy to win? My strategy is to have Daniel win for us. <laughs> what? Yes. And then I'm gonna go get some coffee and sit in front of everybody and eat some donuts. <laughs> Axel, how are you feeling? Bad. So I'm gonna throw up after that marshmallow. What's your strategy to win? Get other people annoyed by throwing stuff at them. Daniel, how are you feeling? <laughs> I feel pretty good. What's your strategy to win? Ah. My strategy is pop and peg. Watch. My oh! Ooh. I just made it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's too bad. That was All right, guys. This is the <laughs> <laughs> You have to make a basket. <laughs> the last one. You get the point. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, Rocket made it. Oh, I made one. 
Daniel's the last one. A couple minutes. Oh, I got it in. Daniel has a strike. He was the last one. From Melanie, Daniel, Finley, Remy. Has a strike. Silent challenge. You guys have to be quiet. If you make one little peep, you're got another strike. All right, three, two, one. Don't talk. Is there a sandwich buried in here? Oh, you're out. You're out of there. Way to go, Ida. Temptation time. Got two doll hairs. Who's gonna squeal? out of my ears on that one. Yeah, so you can talk now. All right, guys, in this next challenge, you can't be in the same place. So you gotta move. Far away. You can't be in the same place anymore. Maybe, maybe he needs one of those C4s. <laughs> yeah, and I'm sweaty. I expelled all my energy, yeah, pegging my family in the head with cubes. Now I have nothing left. All right, you guys ready? The next challenge is the die challenge. What? You're gonna die. No, <laughs> you guys. Roll a die, and whoever gets the lowest one gets a strike. So Finley, you are first. You got a four. Five. Five. I only have like four more people to rely on. All right, Remy. She's got a- Six. Six. It's so hard not to laugh out loud with us. Yes! Five. All right, you ready, Daniel? Three. Three. All right, this is the new challenge of this. The two lowest, which is Daniel and Melanie. What? You got a three, she got a one. You have to hang by the ring over there, and whoever drops first gets a strike. And everybody else, hit him as many blocks as you can. Losing this challenge just put me at two strikes. That just means that one more strike and I'm out. And with how much energy and determination everyone else has, I really feel like I don't have a chance. Plus, Rocket was really pushing my buttons. I don't think I can take another hour, let alone five more minutes of this. Danny, if you get out, you're out. Now, what the heck? Okay, Mom, I'm gonna make your life living crap. This feels like the Mojave Desert right now, trying to make it across. Ready, set, go! Pick up your legs. I get one more strike, guys. Pick up your legs. Come on, you better go! Hit him! Hit him with blocks! Come on! <laughs> Finley has one, Melanie's got one. My kids love Happy Meals more than anything. So I'm gonna order DoorDash and get like this beautiful meal of food for myself. The great and Happy Meals lined up with ice cream cone. I'll just sit there at the edge of the pit and just eat it. It'll be so delicious. <laughs> Three kids meals. Give me it. Give me a marshmallow. Let's do the, the thing. Oh, marshmallow ladder. Right. <laughs> All right, we got a new challenge, guys. Is that an egg? Yeah, but you can't eat them. Everyone grab a spoon. You're gonna put the spoon <laughs> in your mouth. Turn and put your egg. Got Just it. don't drop it. Are you ready? Put your egg on your spoon. <laughs> Oh, Remy is out. It hurts so bad. Oh, Melanie's out. Oh! Oh, Finley's out too. 
Wait, who's still in? Audio, audio. So, okay, audio, audio and Axel, are you ready for a joke? There's two muffins in the oven, <laughs> and one muffin says to the other muffin, whew, it's really getting hot in here, and the other muffin goes, ah! oh my gosh, you're talking muffin. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Melanie has two strikes, Remy has two strikes, Finley has two strikes, Rock has one strike, Audio has two strikes, Axel has one strike. All right, the next challenge. There are three duckies in the pit. We have hid them. If you get a ducky, you're not, you don't get a strike. So ready, set. Four people have two strikes. Good chance for one to get out. Yeah, I promise. <laughs> They're tiny, but you'll find them. Oh. Look at this. Yes! There's a big hole right there. What the kids aren't expecting is that in these bags, I ordered something very tempting. Hopefully, we can at least get one of them out. The biggest threat right now are definitely the older boys. So hopefully, we can get one of them out with what's in these bags. You guys, I got some really, really good food for me and Gary to eat. I got some Happy Meals too. Audio's out. <laughs> All right. Let me show you guys what I got. Oh, look at these beautiful Happy Meals. Look at Rocket. And you can smell the french fries, Finley. They smell so good. Hey, Mom, got you some coffee with Splenda. Oh, McFlurry, Remy. I got a strawberry milkshake and a lemonade. It is so refreshing. So good. Finley, I got a large french fry. <laughs> mm. Peace out. Oh. I, guess, I think that. Wait, Remy's out? Remy's out. What? He had the ducky too. You're so good. I don't know how long we were in there, but it felt like forever. My plan was working with Audio, Axel, and Remy out. I really think Melanie now has a fighting chance to actually win this. Her new biggest threat, Rocket, he only has one strike while Melanie has two. And it seems that Rocket hasn't been phased. She can only hope that she can beat him in whatever mystery challenge comes next. I can smell that. It's very good. Rocket, you can come eat it right now. It is so good. 100 bucks on McDonald's. I'll get the hundred bucks. Yeah. All right, Melanie got one. Oh, ducky, ducky. Are you looking for this? All right, you guys, we need your help. For every like we get, our family will eat one chicken nugget. No. <laughs> he said no. No. <laughs> he said no. Just, I would just have to go to the bathroom with a couple rolls of toilet paper. I'll be like, I'll see you guys like on Tuesday. <laughs> What are you gonna do? Bribe for me. So much fries. You can try and bribe, huh? In the beginning of the challenge, something that I didn't know was that Rocket and Remy actually made a pact and decided to team up. They decided that if one of them wins, they would split the hundred dollars. Family. I don't believe in me. I'm afraid that we're gonna have to end this challenge. If Melanie or Rocket find that duck, you get eliminated. I've been starving for an hour. My foot. I have a headache. I'm thirsty. I'm tired. How do you feel like on a scale of one to ten, like ten being very happy, one being like not happy? A negative. A negative? Okay, if you come out right now, I'll give you fifty dollars. Mom, you get fifty bucks. Sure, fifty five. Yeah. The next challenge is a Marco Polo challenge. Gary's Marco, and his goal is to try and find you guys. So Marco, whoever gets tag. tagged is out. <laughs> he looks like Pat <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Okay, jump in, and once you jump in, then I'm gonna count. 30 seconds for everyone. All right, Gary, jump in. Go, come on. All right, she's counting down to 30. Okay, Gary. Yeah. Marco! Polo! Go, Marco! Polo! I can't even move! Marco, Polo! Remember, Melanie has two strikes, so as long as she can stay away from Gary, she's safe. But if she gets tagged, then Rocket wins, and all my bribery was for nothing. I can't go anymore, man. <laughs> I'm tired. I knew that was gonna happen. 
You didn't even move, basically. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the challenge. Whoever can knock the balloon out of the ring with their foam cube first wins. Got it? Three, two, one, and go. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe.